Well, that intro didn't turn out the way I wanted it to. In my mind, I had something planned completely different. It was supposed to look like this. But I'm just an amateur. I hope I get there one day. Damn it, but I really wanted it to look cool. I even bought a new shirt. Damn. Hey guys, welcome back to... <laughs> oh <my> god... <laughs> These wallpapers that I... <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> All right, I went for a walk and I've calmed down a bit, so let's try and take this again without laughing. Thanks for sticking by so far. Oh, if I was you, I would have been gone by now. Anyway, let's talk about these wallpapers. What's so special about these wallpapers? I'm making this video only because I've had a few people actually ask me about them because uh, they've said, Anthony, every time you do a video, you've got a nice background. Where do you get it from? Because I search on Google and I can't find it. Well, you can't really find these because they belong to Microsoft. Microsoft produces them for their Bing search engine and also for the lock screen on the computer. So when you go away from the computer and your computer goes to sleep, usually you go back to it, wake it up and you see a nice little picture before you put your password in to get back in there. Well, these are the pictures that come up in there. So they're normally very hard to get. But I've discovered a couple of apps that actually allow you to download and also receive uh, one daily with a brief explanation of where that picture was taken and what that picture is all about which is a nice touch <clears throat> excuse me unfortunately you do have to have a windows 10 computer because it only works with windows 10 but i do have a facebook page under my regular everyday business that i use under home computer doctor that i upload for my customers to download freely from there so i'm going to link in the description below where you can click and then I think I've got about 255 pictures in there so far and I keep adding to it every time I get some new ones. So if you have a computer that's earlier than Windows 10, you're welcome to visit my page and download them directly from there. You don't even have to like the page, you can just go there, click on it, right click, save as and bang, you've got it. It's all for free. Um, okay, without a further ado, let's get onto the computer and get cracking. Thanks for watching. Okay guys, the first thing you want to do is open up the Microsoft App Store. It's the little icon that looks like a shopping bag. And simply go right up the top in the search bar and type in daily pick all one word and search. And you'll see the app result daily pick dash Bing wallpapers. Go ahead and click on that. And this will give you the option to install it. Mine's already installed. So I'm just going to click on launch so I can open it up and show you guys what it looks like. And once it's launched, you'll see today's wallpaper and where it came from. And if you click on the three little dots on the right hand bottom corner, it'll give you some more options where you can set it as a desktop wallpaper. So if you go ahead and click on that, it'll give you a notification saying that it's downloaded and installed as a desktop wallpaper. If I minimize these windows and close this, you'll see that now that's my wallpaper. If I go back in there and click on those three dots again, you can also um, select it as a lock screen or you can download all pictures. But whenever you download all pictures, you've got either set by region or all regions. You'll have to pay the additional money if you want the full version of the app and also get rid of the ads. In my situation, I'll just cancel that and do it daily. That's not a problem because just before you click away, I'm going to show you one more app. So we'll go back to the Microsoft App Store again. And this time we search for an app 
called Spot Bright. Scroll down to where you see the apps and you'll see Spot Bright Windows Wallpaper. Go ahead and click on that. This will also give you the same option as before. You can see it's from the same guy that designed the other app. So you will go ahead and install it. I already have it installed, so I'm just going to launch it. And all you have to do, just click on search pictures. Now this will search all the pictures that have been made specifically for the lock screen of your PC. The first time you use it, there's going to be hundreds of them but they're, it's worthwhile to wait, they're really cool pictures. I'll just fast forward through this section because it might take a while. Once it's found all the pictures that it knows, Simply go ahead and click on the download new pictures button and that'll download them physically into your PC. Have a look at them, just click on open download location and that'll give you all the pictures that is downloaded for you to use as desktop backgrounds. Let's have a look at a few. These are today's wallpapers that I've got. Very nice. Beautiful landscapes. You will never be able to find this on Google search. Incredible. You can also go into the settings if you wish, but you don't have to. And you can specify a different folder where the pictures get downloaded to. You can also select whether you want landscape and portrait subfolders as well and then you can download the portrait ones if you wish to have them for your phone and that's about it i hope you enjoyed this video i'm grateful that you hang around with all my laughing <laughs> that was i don't know what got over me and um, i'll talk to you guys in the next one see ya